The recent exploration and discovery of oil in Bunyoro sub-region has brought about many changes in the lives of residents, although the degree of positivity is still a subject to debate. Oil has seen the price of land skyrocket, especially in Hoima and Blizzard district that have been found to possess the reserves of the highly sought after resource. For example, an acre of land in Kanawa Parish the site of the proposed oil refinery previously sold for less than a million shillings. Residents, however, bagged 3.5 million shillings per acre during the government compensation process. There has been uh, an increase in the value of land. People used not to value land, but now uh, they, they, there is that kind of increment in terms of value of land. And also uh, our, our, our children here at the grassroots level, uh, Devanyoro locally, uh, have a chance. There are scholarships which are being given by the oil companies, Talo, Total, uh, both are from primary level up to tertiary institutions. We have a group of uh, students who have gone to uh, the outside world to study the masters in oil and gas and other related things. This revolutionizing of the region's land market has had a negative consequence, however, especially an increase in the number of speculators flocking the area and the subsequent land grabbing that trails them. The discovery of oil came with a lot of uh, expectations, a lot of speculations and many other evils. At the moment, we are having an increment in the cases of land grabbing as a result of our speculations. The influx has uh, left some of the indigenous communities, the traditional indigenous communities, invaded the lay along on land, which they protected communally. For example, they were protecting for grazing. They, could, they were protecting for firewood collection. They were protecting for fishing. So the invasion of these areas, because of displacement of some of the fishing activities from the, the oil area, and because of the compulsory acquisition of the 29 square kilometers of the refinery, it has brought a displacement of some of these people to the next sub-counties, and this has caused the friction. There are also other challenges away from these speculators. We are having situations of homelessness, we have situations of landlessness, we have issues of land insecurity, we have issues of, um, of uh, family breakdown. Because you find a husband has sold land without the consent of the, of, the, of, of, the, of, the, of the spouse or the wife, and they are running to towns. And what does that mean? The family is already disintegrated. Uh, there are, however, concerns that the local community has not been prepared to accommodate their achievements brought about by the discovery of oil and gas in their area. Many feel left out of the development. There are some of the outputs so far they have got. For example, uh, the, the, today, Kigoroya being between the center of Bolisa and Hoima, it, 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 the development of the road infrastructure People are not happy with the development of the road infrastructure from Hoima to Waseko, Isiete Maram Road, and unmotorable throughout the, the season. This is compounded by the fact that oil companies do not consume local agricultural produce which are considered of low quality. This capital outflow from the region is a concern for the local leaders. We have not uh, increasingly uh, uh, prepared our community here in Unio to, 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 to basically understand how well they can sail through this petroleum industry. There is also an upsurge in moral degeneration due to the rapid exposure the community is experiencing. <laughs> Um, 
sono sango mkazi agenza heri yogo mezi buwaye na bakoza bakukora anka mafuta kubaa bakoza bakuwa ni bakora hati wambuta gendo kusanga rundi wa mkazi asigaira aina muenda wambukoza mtransferi ingira agenzele akulekele oinenda otaa kumanya harugire hati ntusigara ntuma nabona na habana anka haba tutaa kumanya wabana hali wakuruga for now, the community has to balance between ripping from the oil industry and fighting the negative impacts the same industry has brought to the area.